Hey everyone, Mr. Happy here, and in this video, I want to let you guys know something that I've seen popping up all day today in all the different gaming news websites. Uh, it's today, January 9th, 2017. Now, many of you may remember a title called Scalebound that was being developed by Platinum Games and was being published by Microsoft Studios for the Xbox. Now, they showed this game off at E3 2015 as a four-player co-op game with some of the biggest boss battles that Platinum Games has ever made. It also showed recently at Gamescom 2016, though it was not playable to the public. While many of us have been very much anticipating the release of Scalebound to see how it does, it appears that Microsoft Studios has put out an official announcement that the game has been canceled and that all development has been ceased. The official statement from Microsoft Studios reads as follows. After careful deliberation, Microsoft Studios has come to the decision to end production for Scalebound. We're working hard to deliver an amazing lineup of games to our fans this year, including Halo Wars 2, Crackdown 3, State of Decay 2, Sea of Thieves, and other great experiences. This comes as a pretty big shock to a lot of us who are at least somewhat interested in what Platinum Games was going to pull out. Personally, I didn't think that the gameplay that was ever shown for Scalebound looked that good, but I always kind of just wanted to see the next step, and maybe it just wasn't a good showcase. Final Fantasy XV had plenty of poor showcases, but they also had some good ones, like the Beluve Mines and the Aranea fight that they showed off. Well, looks like we won't be getting that chance because Scalebound is no more. The last year has been brutal for Platinum Games. I know that they released Star Fox Zero, which I heard had just a horrible reception, and that was bundled with Star Fox Guard, which also apparently didn't do well. To be granted, those were co-developed by Nintendo, but it still has Platinum Games' name right on it. And also the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle game, Mutants in Manhattan, which also did not do very well. So 2016 wasn't exactly Platinum Games year, and we were looking for Scalebound, which by the way was originally slated for a 2016 release and got pushed back to 2017, Scalebound and Near Automata to really be the Platinum Games games that shine in this year. One of those has been thrown off the table, but luckily we still have one more chance for Platinum Games. After the recent reception, and it was a very positive reception, by the way, to the Near Automata demo, at least we can hope that Platinum Games can really deliver the quality of game that a lot of people have come to expect out of the developers. All the same, it still sucks to hear that Scalebound was canceled. We just have to hope that Near Automata can really make up for this last year when it comes out in February for Japan and March for the other parts of the world. But anyway, let me know what you think about Scalebound being canceled in the comment section of the video below. Be sure to go down there and discuss it, and be sure to hit up all the different new websites to get all the different quotes and history references and what's been going on with Platinum Games in the past year. Because apparently it's been pretty rough just in the office for them as well. There's a lot of different articles about it, so I'll let you guys do the searching. I'll maybe include two or three of them in the description of the video below. But anyway, thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care.